Work in my laboratory aims to understand how it is that the brain allows us to learn, to remember, and to use memories to guide our decisions. These abilities are fundamental to everything that we do, and problems in the brain areas that support these abilities underlie some devastating diseases like Alzheimer's, frontotemporal dementia, schizophrenia, depression, and many others. The problem is, right now, we really can't do much to help people with these problems, and in part, that's because we don't understand how the brain works. It's hard to fix something when you don't know how it works. Nonetheless, we are making progress. Work in my laboratory has identified specific patterns of brain activity that underlie an animal's ability to use its past experience to figure out what to do next. And now we're looking to see how these patterns exist across the brain and whether we can amplify them to make the brain better at learning, remembering, and deciding. I think this work is important because it provides a fundamental understanding of how the brain works and also because it may point us to new ways of fixing the brain when it's not working correctly.